I'll tell you, jig heads, we've been using them a lot this year because our shrimp have been really soft on us. And the other thing is that we have a lot of grass. So we need something to really hold our shrimp on our hook. If I just use a regular kale or circle hook, what happens is after a couple of pops, the shrimp are soft or I get it caught in some grass, it rips it right off the hook. When I have the ability to put a shrimp on a jig head, I thread more of the meat. It gets a lot more of the shrimp on the jig head to where it doesn't peel off as easy when I'm out there fishing, especially popping the cork. Because this year we got a little bit of wind, the water's been really dirty. You gotta pop that cork and make a lot of noise to catch those fish. All right, let's see. All right, get that shrimp out of my live well. Now just using a regular quarter ounce jig head, the proper way, okay, and this is, this is the key. You've gotta put that hook right in the tail. You can't come up further. You have to be right in the tail because there's a hard part there that holds the hook. You go in and put the shrimp around the hook and when it gets to the straight shank of the hook right there, it's on the straight part of the hook, that's when you pull the shrimp out. And the reason for that is now that shrimp will be perfect like this. If he wants to pop and move on the bottom while you pop, look just like that, that fish will see that, hear that, and that'll hold that shrimp on there for you so you don't lose them.